What's going on guys? So today I'm going to show you how to deal with copyright claims on YouTube. So here I am in my YouTube studio for my older channel because in my current one I don't have any copyright claims. But back in the day I used to upload some CSGO gameplay on another channel and I would get a bunch of claims because I would just use songs that uh, weren't in public domain, like they weren't copyright free. So I have a bunch of examples here to work with and I'll just show you how to deal with this. So in my YouTube studio here under videos, I can see all my videos that have claims under the restrictions column. And then I'm just gonna go to the first one and just use this as an example. So I'm gonna hover over this copyright claim and then click see details. And here we go, now we have the information. So it's gonna tell you the content uh, duration of the copyright claim. It's gonna tell you who claimed it. So in this video, I did use Logic's song and yes, he is a part of Visionary Music Group. So it does make sense that this video got claimed, but I didn't know any better at the time. But if it wasn't, or if you wanna still get rid of this claim, there are some actions you can do. So you can click select action here and you can replace the song, you can mute the song or you can dispute it. So I'm gonna show you guys how to replace the song really quick. The issue with this uh, way to deal with it is that you'll see once I replace the song, it's gonna replace all of the audio in the video with this song. So in this gameplay, I have like some gunshot sounds, like the game, the volume of the game is in this gameplay. But if I click any of these uh, songs, it's gonna get rid of the copyrighted song, all of the audio and just replace it with one of these non-copyright songs. So I'll just show you what I mean really quick. This is what it sounds like before the claim. Basically, you can hear the gunshots and stuff. And then if I click add to video on any of these. <laughs> as you can hear, no more gunshots, no more gameplay, just the uh, non-copyright song. So if that's what you want to do, that is one way to get rid of this claim. But um, yeah, I'm just going to go to revert to original. That's not what I want. If you want to save that, just click save changes and video, will, I mean, YouTube will process your video, but I'm going to go back to revert to original and show you another way how to deal with this. Actually, you can just close this tab. It's not important. Um, and then you go back to select action. You can do mute song. And there's two options here. Mute all sound when song plays. So this basically does what the last thing did, except instead of replacing the song, it's gonna mute the video wherever the uh, claimed song plays. This works, this will get rid of your copyright claim, but it's gonna mute all the audio in your video. And then there's another option here called mute song only, which is still in beta. And it try YouTube tries to remove the uh, claimed song, however, it's not a hundred percent. It'll remove some audio in your video. It'll make it sound muffled Not the best option, but it still is an option So I'm gonna click this and show you guys what happens and then there's an option under here called preview muted video So just select that and now YouTube's gonna load a preview um, It might take longer than the first option the first option uh, loads a preview pretty quickly just because it just mutes the whole video, but I'll just wait for this to load real quick. Okay, here we go, it's loaded. So now when I click preview, I wanna lower the volume of this because it's gonna blast your guys' ears. You can hear the gameplay still and there's no more songs. So honestly, this is probably the best option to deal with your copyright claims. Although as you can still hear, the volume of the gameplay sounds, it doesn't sound the best. It sounds kind of muffled, but you know what? YouTube does its best job with this. So I would recommend doing this. I wouldn't recommend the first one. That one's just gonna mute your video and who's gonna wanna watch like a completely muted video, right? So yeah, just go with that one. But there is another way to do this. Like another way to deal with this copyright claim rather. So I'm gonna go cancel. And then finally we have dispute. Now this, you only select this if you feel like you are unfairly copyright claimed. Like if you feel like this video doesn't deserve to be claimed, like if you're using a song that you made and it's getting claimed, 
no, like that shouldn't happen. So click dispute. In my case, I, it should be claimed, but you know, it's uh, I'm showing a tutorial for all cases, right? And if you fall under any of these three, uh, YouTube basically tells you, no, you cannot claim this video or you cannot fight the claim. But if you don't, you select this checkbox here. I'll let you guys read all this stuff. I'm not gonna explain it all. But if you don't, just select this checkbox here and then go continue. And it's going to give you some options of why you feel like your video shouldn't be claimed. So there are some uh, options here. I'm going to go with fair use. I'll leave this up to you guys to read and fill out however you want. But I'm going to go fair use. And then go continue. And YouTube's still going to give you some reasons why. Even if you think you're fair use, it still might not work. So yeah. Um, and if you still believe that you deserve to have the rights to your video, you click the checkbox here and then go continue. And then you have a text box here to type why you feel like your video is fair use. Now, I suggest you take your time with this and explain properly why you feel like your video should not be claimed because this goes right to YouTube. But I, I don't really care about this video, so I'm going to go test. I'll leave that up for you guys to fill in. And you got to select all three of these and then fill in your signature. So I'm going to go, oh, full legal name. Um, I'm not trying to put my full legal name on this video, but yeah. Anyways, once you're done with this, you can click submit and then it will file your claim to YouTube and YouTube will let you know if you pass it or not. So that is how you deal with the copyright claim. That's three ways. Hopefully you guys found this video helpful. If you did, please drop a like and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.